Hamida Rahman. I'm from Queens, New York, and I'm currently an MBA student. I came here with my fiance, Sazad, uh, my brother-in-law, uh, Kamrul Hussein, and my brother, Asif Rahman. I'm Sazad. I'm from Queens, New York, and I am a product designer. Hi, my name is Kamrul Hussein. I am Sazad's uh, younger brother, and Fumida is my sister-in-law. I'm Asif Rahman, and I'm the younger brother of the bride. I've met my fiance actually way years down the road. Our family's known each other for 15 plus years, but we've actually only met in 2016. Mutual family member actually exchanged his, our, my number to him and told him to give me a call. And from then on, you know, we went on and here we are. Fomida and I went to on a date and she asked me a question on the very first date that made me feel like she was the person I wanted to spend the rest of my life. I would say a cute moment would be a surprise proposal that he planned for me. We went to a shop to look at couches and we randomly started dancing at the shop. And that moment, she just looks so beautiful just twirling around. And I feel like her characteristic there just carries on every day. I'm getting married in fall in Elite Palace in Queens, New York. Our theme is a royal theme, so we are trying to do a little bit of gold, a combination of red and uh, other colors. I think the reason he chose me to come to pick out the dress is because I have the better fashion statement of all the brothers. Uh, I have not bought my outfit yet. Uh, Fumita is going to buy and I'll try to match hers. What made us come to Nizrana was a recommendation from a friend who saw the television show and said, uh, hey, you should come and check this place out. They have very beautiful outfits. Welcome to Nizrana. My name is Shia. Hi, uh, I'm Sazad. Hi, Sazad. I'm Fumita. Hello. Cameron. Cameron. I'm Asif. Hi, Asif. So I'm going to help you guys today. What can I help you with? We're actually here to find my wedding reception um, dress. We're actually open to almost anything, but the main thing is that I do not want any skin showing. Okay. It has to be a bit conservative. Um, so what would you recommend for that? I'm going to avoid langas. I'm going to show you lachas. And I think that'll be really pretty for a nighttime event. Okay, that sounds good. Did you guys have anything in mind for her in terms of color? I think a traditional red would be nice. Okay. I don't think, um, I would prefer to stay away from a lot of jewelry on the dress. So I think that anything that really makes her pop with the, the red traditional color would be nice. Great. And then did you have anything in mind for her as well? Yeah, I was thinking since we're a clash of two different cultures, both from Bangladeshi and American, that we would try to honor both of that. And if she's happy with what she gets, perhaps I could find something that matches her and find a uh, outfit for myself as well. Great. Uh, did you guys have any budgets in mind for either of you? Honestly, it comes down to what we end up liking. Uh, so we're open to any budget. So I'm going to get started with you then first. Um, I'm going to head in the back, pull a few options. In the meantime, you guys can get seated over here. And we'll get started. So Famita, I picked out lachas for you today because you mentioned you don't want to show any stomach. So the first one I pulled, Anshul's going to bring it out. It's this beautiful gray piece. So Famita, this is a lacha. So it has a plain gray skirt underneath and this sits on top of it. It has the sleeves. It's not going to show any stomach. What do you think of that piece? I think it's nice. I'm, I'm not too sure about the color, but I like how it has a lot of work going on. Um, I don't mind trying it on. Okay. What do you guys think? Don't think it'll suit her well, but I mean, let's let her try it on just to see. I'm not really sure about the color. I thought you wanted to go a little bit more traditional. And I think with all your jewelry, this won't really make it stand out like you wanted it to. Doesn't look bridal and you're going for a grand theme and it's not popping out to me. Do you still want her to give it a shot and see what it looks like? Yeah, yeah. Let's give it why a not? Shot, yeah. Let's keep this aside and we'll look at the next option. Okay. 
Zephamita, the second one that I picked is of course more traditional. Um, a lot of brides tend to wear red and it has exquisite embroidery, it's entirely handmade. And again, it comes with a red skirt underneath. If you decide to try it on, you'll see the full look. I like it. I, I like how it's red. Um, it's something that's traditional, like you said. So um, I think my mom would be happy, so we can give it a shot. Okay. What do you guys think? I mean, it does have the red, but again, I'm not really seeing her in that dress. I just, I guess I just have to see how she looks in it. Okay. It looks really good. I think it's going to look very regal, but that goes with our theme of the wedding. And I think your jewelry will stand out quite a lot. What do you think? I actually like it, and I think we're heading in the right direction. The red theme does make it pop. All right, so we'll definitely try this on, and we'll keep looking. So for me, the third one I picked, it's a deeper color, but it has really, really pretty embroidery. And if you look closer, it has blush accents, the inverted scallops. And when you try it on, you'll see it has a beautiful train in the back. I really like it. I love the red. I love the gold. I think I would definitely want to try this on. I think there's a lot happening with that dress. Well, she is getting married, so it is going to be is, a lot. She is, but at the same time, you know, she does want to stand out. I don't think that's what will make her stand out that much either. I like how it detailed it is, but I am a little concerned about the trail being a little too long. I want to kind of twirl her on the dance floor. I don't know if that will be possible with something this long. She'll try it on and you will see how comfortable it is, but I honestly, I think it'll be okay. Great. So Famita, so far I've picked two traditional pieces. Um, the gray, the lavender, I kind of want to show you something a little more modern and see if you like that. Um, it's nice and sparkly. The color is very different. It's not something I ever imagined, but again, because I am open to the many options, I don't mind trying it on to see how it looks. What do you guys think? I'm sorry, I don't like that at all. It, it looks like someone bedazzled a pair of jeans and put it together. It just doesn't look oh, all that well, right to me. You'll see the full cut though. You're not seeing it on her right now. Yeah, but I'm not sure. The color doesn't even stand out to it. Honestly, I don't like the color, but I think if you try it on, it's going to give you a better idea. I actually like the color, but I'm not a fan of the design. Kind of looks a little too much happening. Well, let's do this. So far, we've looked at four options. Let's start trying these on and see where we go and which ones you like. So, so how did you guys hear about us? Actually, it was a recommendation from a friend who said they saw your TV show. And I'm not the biggest fan of those uh, Bridezilla or going with the bride shows. I decided to watch it and I, she loved the outfits that you guys showed. So we said, why not just give it a shot? It's interesting because so far I've never had a bride come just with guys to help her pick her outfit. It's new to me. So I want to see how it goes. Well, we'll find out. So Famita, what do you think of this one? I'm not too sure. Um, again, the color seems a little dull. I do like the trail, though. I'm not quite sure, though. I think the color is taking me down. So what do you guys think about it? I'm not a big fan of it. Like she said, I, I don't like the color. And it kind of looks like the dress kind of oversized her. It looks like she shrunk in it. So well, also keep in mind, this is not her size, right? This is yeah. just a piece she's trying on. Of course, it's going to be made for her. I get that, but still, it just it's just something I don't think my Bobby would be wearing. You know, I don't, I don't envision her wearing something like that. Okay. What do you think, Sasad? I think there'll be a lot of guests that comes to the wedding and uh, you'll kind of blend in with the rest of the crowd. I feel like you should go with a little bit more color. Asif, what do you think? I like the lacha thing, but I don't like the neck at all. I like the fact it has the train, but the color, the design, it's not working well together. So for me, to, let's try the red one and see how that one looks. Okay. Go ahead. I think it's nice, but honestly, I don't think it's like a wedding vibe. It's just the color is not right for me. I think I would like something a little more brighter. I don't think it's quite what she was looking for. Um, all of the embroidery on it, not a big fan, you know, to be honest. It's a decoration on it, color, everything. I, I think it was a heavy no for me. What do you think of this one? Um, I really like it. I love the color. I love the work. I like how it's bright. It's eye-capturing. But I don't know if I, I... I think I want the trail. 
um, which I think this dress is missing and maybe like a little bit covered up over here. So you like the red tone better than the pastel. Yes. What do you guys think? Quick question, are you able to move in that? Because I feel like the dress is almost carrying you <laughs> instead of you carrying the dress um, around. It's not too bad actually. It's actually really? better being in it than... I really think there's just a lot happening with the dress too, with the with all the beads, all the the bedazzlements. It's this this does not look that right for you. I actually disagree, and I feel like the bedazzle kind of makes it pop. And after all, it's her day. The only thing is that maybe the color could be a little darker. But other than that, it's a beautiful dress. I feel like your mother's gonna love this dress, and I feel like no one else within the wedding venue would have this specific color because it's so ingrained in our mind. So you definitely don't. I'm not a big fan. I think more subtle gold would be much better for you. So her brother mentioned that Famida does like traditional Bengali looks, which are mostly reds and gold, pinks and gold. And that's why I wanted to throw in a mix and show her a red outfit. I do think it's really appropriate. I'm just not sure if she's gonna like the level of embroidery on this piece. Red is a bit too bright for my taste, but um, I think uh, we're going in the right direction. Famida, what do you think about this dress? I love it. I think I actually love everything about it. I love the little flares in the bottom part of the skirt. The chill is huge and I think that's my favorite. Honestly, I don't think I have an issue with anything. My issue with the last dress was that there was a lot of gold happening. I think this one has actually a little more than that. Dude, is there any dress you like? All of them you just said you don't like. I mean, listen, I'm here to give feedback and I think that it's just... Yeah, but you kind of have to, you know, be a little less of a pickiness, uh, just say something that you like about it or... I think that I have a good positive feedback in what you might like and what might not I mean, like. What and is I it think, that's bothering you about this one? Again, the same thing as the last dress. I think that there's just too much happening. Asif, no. what did you think? I completely disagree with him. I feel like this is the one. She looks happy in it. She looks confident. And I think that's, that's all that matters for her day. We do have one more dress remaining. We can just try that out and see maybe whatever you think is missing. Maybe we can see if we could find that. Yeah, I think. I do think it meets pretty much all your requirements. Um, I just want to see what Cameron has to say. I'm just yeah. curious to know what he, what's nice for him. Because for me, I feel like it can't get any better than this. I think this dress is the one. It's not a bright red, it's a maroon. It has perfect gold accent. The pink embroidery is in there. I think it's just I don't think it can get any better. I think this is it. I feel that my brother is entitled to his own opinion, but I feel that a lot of the comments he is giving to her is affecting her uh, her choice, her decision. I feel that he should add a little bit positive feedback to his uh, explanations, and I feel that it's going to help her feel a little bit more welcomed and happier in the dress she does end up getting. Mira, what do you think about this one? I think it's a pretty dress, but honestly, I think I just fell in love with the third dress, so I kind of don't really see anything over here. <laughs> what do you guys think? I feel like the color disappeared. I I'm not sure what happens. I feel like that's something that I will use as a curtain, no offense, but I'm not a big fan of that dress. I think that last dress kind of wowed all of us, except him, because he's the... Yeah, but this one, it's just, it doesn't compete. It's nice, but I think it's pointless to continue looking forward for more dresses because the third one was just perfect. I think I would actually just go for the third dress. I think it had everything that I am looking for, and I think I would feel like a bride. I think it's your choice. Um, you know, you are the star of the day, so it really just depends on you if you really think it's the one that you'd like. I don't even think it's like a compromise. I think it's just wow for me. What his wife has to say when she picks <laughs> Well, let's not go there. Let's focus here today. We'll get to that when we get to that. Honestly, the third one was my favorite. I felt like you just glowed up like no other. Do you want to purchase the maroon dress? I think I want to. So I guess I want to ask you the question. So Famida, are you ready to be an Azrana bride? Yes, I'm ready to be an Azrana bride. So now since so that Famida's picked her outfit, I'm gonna have Shashan come out. He's our menswear designer and he'll help you find your outfit. Sounds great. Hey. Hi. 
So that's our bride, Famita, and that's the groom, Sazad. They're getting married next year. Famita picked not this dress. It's a burgundy lacha, and then Sazad needs a matching outfit to that. Okay, sounds good. Okay, good luck. I'll see you in alterations. Thank you. Hey, so congratulations. How about we have Ancho take you so you could change out, and I can see what Sazad likes and pick out outfits accordingly. Okay. So Sad, did you have any sort of requirements for your Shivani? Like, did you want something heavy? Did you want something simple? We're actually a clash of two different cultures. She's honoring the Bengali side of it with the red. I thought I could honor the American side with something a lighter color. Maybe something close to white, but not fully white. Sounds good. Uh, let me pick out a couple outfits for you. Um, by the time she'll be here too, so we can take a look at it together. Sounds great. So Sad, I've picked out a couple of outfits for you. So I picked this one because it's a little different. It's a raw silk base. It's very light, so you'd be very comfortable in it. What do you think about this one? I like the color, but I feel like there's a little bit more going on than to my liking, but it's something I could try on. Okay. What do you think about this? I'm not a big fan of the figurines. They kind of don't match at all with her dress, but again, you know, try it on, see how it is. Yeah, I agree. I like the design, but except for the birds and elephants, but we can definitely try it on and just see how it looks. And what about you? I agree. It's, the figures are not doing it, but it's worth the shot. Sounds good. So we'll put it in the maybe pile and we'll have you try it on. Okay. So Sazad, I picked this one out for you because it's that light cream that you wanted. It has a hint of the maroon from, from her outfit. What do you think about this one? You know, when you first brought it out, I thought there was a lot going on, but the closer you got, I kind of liked the different contrast you have. And like you said, the red completely matches her outfit. And I actually like the little dangly thing that's right there. I think it makes it stand out a lot more, and it's very unique compared to all of the ones we've seen so far. What do you think? You know what, surprisingly, I actually do like it. I think it's pretty unique. That's the first. <laughs> what do you think? I love how unique it looks. It looks modern, it looks classy. I think we should try it on. What about you? I definitely agree. It's, it's going to complement the bride very well with her dress. So I think we have two solid ones to try on. Let's see how you feel about them. All right, sounds good. Um, so I'll have her bring out the first one and she can take you in. Okay. Try it on. So how do you feel about this one? Honestly, I like the color, but all these animals, it feels like I'm in the zoo. So I'm not, I, I don't know about this one. I, I think I would rather get something else. Okay. Yeah, uh, for me too. How do you feel about this one? I think we can do better. Maybe a little more work or maybe a little more red. Um, I'm not sure, I'm not really feeling this one. So how do you feel about this one? Design-wise, like you said, you're, you fit right in the zoo. You, you're <laughs> right there as the Lion King right now, I'll tell you that much. I like the color, but I feel like it should be grand without the animals. Yeah, so I guess it's a universal mold. Let's have you try on the next one. There was a little bit too much going on with the dress. Uh, the different animals that was there did not really suit what I was looking for. I felt that I was more in a zoo than I was at a wedding. The animal print Shivani that Shazad tried, I thought it looked good on him. Uh, the colors worked for him. I think color-wise he was okay with too, but the animals were a no-go. And it's usually the case with that Shervani, it's, it's really either a hit or a miss. And I guess for Shazad and company, that one didn't really work out. So Shazad, so how do you feel about this one? I actually really like it. I think the combination of colors and the simplicity along with the complicated work that's going on is very nice. I especially like this one. It kind of makes you want to play around with it a little. All the combination of different things work. I'm not really sure about the pants. I think I heard something called like a toti or something like that. But overall, I love the set. Yeah. Mita, how do you feel about this one? Um, I think it's perfect. I really like it. I love the that side of the work and it gives such a perfect royal vibe. I really like it. What about you? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna break from tradition and say that's actually really, really nice. Yeah, and just like the buttons, I think that over there it looks just looks really clean. There's yeah, also I, I like a like it. rope piece in the back. Oh, there you go. She can hold it as a leash, so it's good on that. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think about this I actually song? really like it and I feel like the details are on point. The little chain feature, the belt-like, 
and I like how one side is less simple than the other and I really like the details on the arm. Now would this pair with something else or should I just... Yeah, so definitely the, the shoes, um, if you're interested, the scarf and the safa. I really like this piece, I think I'm gonna get this one. Yeah, congratulations, man. Surprisingly, from all the things that I've seen today, I think the Shirwani, the second Shirwani he put on today was definitely my favorite outfit that he had on. In terms of Sushant, I do think he hit it right on the nail. That second Shirwani was just great. And if I came to him and he showed me that for my wedding, then I'd, I'd definitely be happy about that. I felt that Shushant was very accepting of what I wanted. I felt that he listened to my needs. Um, he also was accepting of the feedbacks I gave him and he was able to come up with something that I truly loved. I'm definitely very happy with both my dress and his outfit. I think it's exactly what we had envisioned or even better. I am very excited for a final day. If you enjoyed watching this video, please like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Nazana Diaries.